This is well documented, and the establishment that protects them has engaged in a massive cover-up of widespread criminal activities at the State Department and the Clinton Foundation in order to keep the Department and the Clinton Foundation in order to keep the Clintons in power. Never in history have we seen such a cover-up. Never in history have we seen such a cover-up as this. One that includes the total destruction of 33,000 emails, 13 iPhones, some by hammer, laptops, missing boxes of evidence, and many, many other things. People who are capable of such crimes against our nation are capable of anything. And so now we address the slander and libels that was just last night thrown at me by the Clinton machine and the New York Times and other media outlets as part of a concerted toward the exact same moment and all together at the same time as WikiLeaks releases documents exposing the massive international corruption of the Clinton machine, including 2,000 more emails just this morning. These vicious claims about me of inappropriate conduct with women are totally and absolutely false. And the Clintons know it, and they know it very well. These claims are all fabricated. They're pure fiction, and they're outright lies. These events never, ever happened, and the people that said them meekly fully understand you take a look at these people, you study these people, and you'll understand also. The claims are preposterous, ludicrous, and defy truth, common sense, and logic. We already have substantial evidence to dispute these lies, and it will be made public in an appropriate way and at an appropriate time very soon. These lies come from outlets whose past stories and past claims have already been discredited. 